hi guys um welcome back to my channel if today is your first time visiting my youtube channel my name is Olua Kemi from Lagos Nigeria guys I'm gonna be making this colorful lovely mini wallet you know it comes with um pocket guys please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget to on your notification button and don't forget to like my video share comment thank you very much guys and god bless you guys i'm gonna be making use of gum stay you know alongside with the fabric that i'm gonna be using for my mini wallet so guys um this is the um, fabric part Basically, what I did was I took the measurements. This is a this is a Chemtex board. This is the board I used um, for making this bag. So from here to this place is five inches. Why from here? This is the bottom. From here to this place is one inch. Then from here to this place is um five um inch. No, sorry. So guys, I make use of um, board and um, foam for this job. This is the board I use, Chemtex um, leather board. So from here to this place is um, 4 inches, while from here to this place is 1 inch, while from here to this place is 4 inches. So this is the bottom of, you know, of the bag. This is the bottom. So guys, basically what I did right now is, let's say this is my board now you know i then i applied gum here and i put um i applied my foam my foam on top of it then after putting the foam then i attach my you know fabric to it so guys um this is the inner part of it and this is velvet i've already wrapped it so basically what i did was i removed um it's the same measurement i used but i removed 0 0.1 here 0 0.2 here 0 0.2 here 0 0.1 here and 0 0.1 so that is how i did the measurement i just you know reduce it um all round then after that i wrapped it with uh, my velvet so guys what i'm gonna be doing right now is uh, I'm gonna be you know making the pocket aspect of the bag you know this is a mini wallet so this is um, the pocket this is how it's gonna be look like so right now what I'm doing right now is I'm cutting it this is a this is gum stay and this is my fabric here so so um, this is what I'm doing right now uh, this is what I'm doing right now. So I'm trying to um, cut out the pocket of um, my purse Guys, um, this is a pocket. So the measurements for the width is eight and a half point one while the um, length is seven and a half Guys, um, what I'm gonna be doing now is to fold them together. But before then I'm just gonna show you the other um, measurements so this other one, the measurements of the width, the measurements for the width of this is um, eight and a half point one, and the length is um, five inches. While the third one, the third one, the measurement of the width is seven and a half, while the um, length is six, the six inches. So guys, um, what I'm going to be doing is to, you know, apply my gum and then, you know, gum them together. I'm still applying my gum to the fabric. I'm going to be applying it to, you know, to the both sides and also to the down part of the fabric then I'm just gonna allow it to get dry a bit and fold them together guys I'm still um folding folding the pocket together I'm still trying to fold it trying to make it you know 
very neat so when you're trying to fold the pocket you just need to be careful like I said always you know let your gum get dried first before you start you know folding now this is the um i'm just gonna fold that into two like that you know after doing that after folding it then i'm just gonna take my um iron and then press it out because i want the shape to come out nice i really want to you know i really want the shape to come out very well so after gumming it together i'm just gonna use um iron to you know to iron um the pocket aspect so guys um when you're you know doing this bag you just need to be mindful and be careful of the pattern you need to follow the pattern of the fabric um so that your you know your bag can come out nice and beautiful and also colorful you can see how colorful this looks like just have to follow the pattern so so that it can come out nice guys I'm gonna be um, stitching the pocket so this is like a two pocket joined together that is where I'll be having my credit card you know whatever card I have I'm just gonna be you know using that with it so so guys I, I'm, I'm attaching um, the three pockets together trying to sew them together you know where you know the the pocket you can use it to you can you know put anything inside of it money credit card whatever thing whatever card you want to put inside it's gonna stay you know it's gonna contain it right so so guys after you know stitching that part I'm just gonna go to the next part where I'm gonna be sewing a single pocket only so that is what I'm doing I'm sewing um, you know the single pocket and I'm making use of a black thread for my job and the machine I'm using right now is a straight sewing industrial machine And don't forget guys always double stitch your work you know always double stitch so guys I'm making more of this purse more of this wallet for my customer is it's you know it's a customer's order so I'm making more of it for her she ordered it and you know this order is not in Nigeria it is out of Nigeria it is um, in Canada so I'm making all of this you know and it, you guys are going to love it I'm what I'm doing right now is um, applying my gum to you know to my leather board I want to gum um, the zip to the leather board basically that is what I'm doing trying to attach um, my zip to my leather board that to my inner part leather board so I'm done doing that right now I'm trying to come the bottom aspect of you know of the zip to the leather board I'm applying my gum after applying the gum I'm just gonna wait for it to get dry a bit Um, this is my um, this is one of the pearls that I've made now but I've not um, done the final stitching I've not done the final stitching which I'm still going to do guys this is dried already I'm just gonna gum that together you know just gum it make it flat you know very flat Now I'm trying to make sure that the 
edges are equal so that uh, my zip or so that my bag can be straight because I don't want one side you know to the other side and the other part another side I want it to be equal so right now what I'm doing is I'm applying gum to the outer part of my mini wallet <laughs> I'm applying gum there and after applying gum to the outer part I'm gonna be applying it to the inner part as well and then you know just leave it to dry a bit before you know gumming them together I'm almost through with this pores it's already you know looking very beautiful and lovely and I can just wait to see you know to see the finishing of this pores because I think I'm loving it and I think I'm gonna be making one for myself I really love it right I love it so so much it's really really I know it's gonna be nice it's gonna be lovely guys um it's dried already so right now i'm placing the both together trying to place them together you know then comb them together before the finer stitches while doing this you need to be very very careful you need to be extremely careful you need to place them well you need to place them right so that when you're stitching, it's not going to give you, um, you know, a, a whole lot of stress. Guys, I'm true, you know, gumming them together. So, I'm just going to stitch them together. Guys, I'm using a cylinder bed and smashing right now to, you know, st stitch them round. To stitch them round together so right now I am sewing body outer part and the you know the inner part of my mini wallet guys thanks so much for watching this is the um this is the end of today's tutorial thanks so much for watching thanks so much for your massive support I'm so grateful guys um please don't forget to subscribe don't forget to on the notification bell don't forget to you know like my videos thank you very much and god